Yo, what's up, y'all? God of War. You know it. <sighs> it's gonna be uh, crazy because, to be honest, like nothing about it. I'm, I'm like trying to do two separate gameplays. Like, so I'm not gonna go to War. It was like the worst idea for me. But uh, yeah. When I finished God of War, is I'm actually uh, pre-recording something special for everyone actually <laughs> this is like it's probably gonna be surprising right now but it's actually gonna be really gameplay How of did you a do nice that? game we cannot trust her because she's a god have i taught you nothing boy but she's helped us a lot she lied some people value the privacy best not to judge brother when i require your counsel head i will ask fair enough Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Better to tell okay. us the way. The world serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? So Indeed. pretty much, um, speaks an obscure tongue I am more ancient even than these mountains. The, I mean, the game's been None out for a long time already. Like, like, it's been out since like, of course, for um, me. Before 2019, I'm pretty sure. I just don't know. know to look at him, but your I don't, I don't know the uh, precise date of it, but it's gonna be a gameplay, and pretty much, I'm telling y'all the truth right now. Like this channel probably may not have the the best best quality of games and stuff. Like I'm I'm really doing like games. Okay. And I'm and honestly, do I have fun doing these games? Yes I do. Like these are actually gameplays that are fun. I mean, sure there's probably like better content like Vanguard. I mean I'm so posting some Vanguard, but it's not the best content. Why did Freya spin your face? Actually, no. Speak of Baldur. He claims nothing harms him. I mean he has Aye. content. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved, uh, a spell? Mimir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. Hope he's not broken. Hey, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. I need that alchemist for that something horn. I'm stewing up for you. If in your smart, you'll find him. I see. Just wanted to stare into my eyes. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna be doing some gameplays this to ease up this channel so there could be a variety of things people can watch especially like school accounts because like, for school accounts if you have school computer and stuff and you want to watch youtube I, you know you know my channel and stuff it's kinda, you can't even do I that put my lips to the horn because they block out some of my videos especially my god award videos <laughs> That statue made in honor of Thor. And seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But Dang. Doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. Our only concern is Jotunheim. All right, wish me luck.
this is I've still got it, lads. You remember me. Why are you Oh no, that's not right. Uh Mokuno the pain of your loss. He will help you. Curious. What is it? Oh, nothing to be concerned about. What is he doing? Making sure we're headed in the right direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Is that one of the people we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, I know where it is. And it's not far. He looks kind of mad for a moment. Now that, he thought I said you were friends of Odin. You'll forgive me. I've never spoken the ancient tongue sober. <laughs> Wait, look! The water's dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. Okie dokie. I'll explore, to be honest. Let's get that chisel. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now, or go exploring for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Boat under the bridge, keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen, then thread past between them. Amir, you never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? <laughs> Precisely. <laughs> enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. You were taken from this realm too early. You who walks among the living, my beloved Gulvig calls to me. She yearns for peace, yet her remains lie in pieces. I beg of you. Make my Gulvig whole again. You want us to collect her bones? Gross. Gulvig's sather magic knows no bounds. She can reunite you with those you've lost. Really? How? Boy. I can smell your grief, child. Rest assured, her magic is strong enough to create bridges between life and death. 
if only for a short while. Boy, we are leaving. They've taken three of Sweet Gulvik's uh, bones and uh, spread them across the lake. Uh, Bring me her bones, child. Gulvik will reward you. Uh, sauce. Just mad sauce right there. Good. The special chisel is ahead past this gate. Focus up, boy. You got him joking. What? We should look for those bones. Why? Didn't you hear him? We could talk to mom again. If we keep an eye out. Look while if we... you wish, boy. I will not be distracted by this fool's errand. Fine, Trace. You know. This chisel we seek. What is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <clears throat> there was a giant once named Famu. A very giant giant, who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamur hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son, but young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Arimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son. But in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night. So far from home. Thor. And? What happened next? You'll see. Oh, doll. Oh. killed him. Oh, no. He fell in the village? Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. Dangerous beast. We will take him down together. Enemies. What in the Wolverine? Go! <laughs> 
boy. We seek a chisel. The tip of one, yes. A very, very giant chisel. That is so sweet. <laughs> also, I should be hurting Kratos, but okay. What happened to the survivors? Oh, Thamur was a frost giant. When he died, his final breath froze everything. something to get through this one. Atreus, to me! Almost missed that one. Let's go. Find the tip of that chisel. That's the magic we need. You gotta be joking. Find light crystal. Wonder what it's for. Boom. Hey, how did the world trees that? Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, not gonna really look inside dead bodies kinda creepy. Okay, that's... Oh my god, that's brutal. You two make quite a formidable duo! What is that? Oh. What does it say? Yes, sir. From Njord, we offer back the sea stuff. Ah, yes. It was believed that Njord calmed the winds and seas for the fishermen. For that, they loved and worshipped him here. Oh. I have 20. Oh. Oh, dang. Hold up.
Alright, time to mess with the orb. Quite frankly, I'm gonna just save just in uh j j just in a case, you know, just a security measure, you know. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I felt dumb. I that uh I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother, but I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. Oh boy. Right. That's injury. Wow, that was uh, something that the uh, fight. <laughs> Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. You can be invisible? 
More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> You let him touch this again. <laughs> Come on, then. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between rows. Okay, now, shush. I need complete silence for this. There Just with a bang of the hammer, it looks like you're on the Let's get to it. Oh, uh, oh, I already, already, um, oh, can I already see these? Oh, that's cool. I can already buy the ancient belt. Okay, now let's get this flaming stuff. Oh, no, we can't forget you. Yes, we are going to forget you. Can we get the ancient stuff? I don't suppose you could try to get the plane. What? No? No, just a... It was a question. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I do need some locality. Come back any time. Uh, wait, no, yes, yes, come in. Yes, my young man? I think you'll be pleased, young man. Something else for you, then? That should tide you over. Now, there is something else to tell you. Let's do it. Hold up. Okay, no lost items. I think 
think that's a keeper. Well, that's something. Don't be a stranger. Oh, for <laughs> that one last thing, let me just equip some stuff. Your shop's fine. So what are you doing up here? I'm on a hunt for scap slag. Slap what? Scap. Slag. Ores with specific impurities that are the key to unlocking all sorts of unique qualities. This <laughs> waste product is another man's artistic medium. Come boy. Coming. We heading into that building? Yes. Do you think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Mm. I'll keep thinking. That was hard to be honest. You know what? I give it to Atreus. He he is right about that. That was actually hard. Come here. You knew this place before? I came here on a diplomatic mission once, trying to broker a peace between Asgard and Vanaheim. That war. So many lives lost. What I didn't know was Thor had already gone on a killing spree of giants. What did the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's lust for blood.
Oh, shoot! Let me get that. Um... How do you, how do you even get this? Can't even make that. Yeah, I, I know, Trace. I'm trying to understand. I'm trying to think, how do I... If I really want it. Oh man. You know what? I'll leave it for another time. Well, stealthy plan it is not. Now we must free the other strap. I see that. I see that crystal. Can I reach it? Oh, 
Can you reach it? That's a bruh. all the way down there. Think. Well, the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice, so melting it won't work. Correct. And there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot, so that's not an option. Correct. That just leaves smash from the ice. We need something ridiculously heavy to... Oh, I get it now. Good. How are we going to turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip? Not possible. We cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck. You are welcome to suggest a different one. <laughs> We get to it. We cannot. Here, boy. What does it say? When time itself is disarrayed, the forward path is retrograde. Retrograde? Backwards? Those symbols. The seasons? Yeah, but the order's all jumbled. Shouldn't it be winter, spring, summer, autumn? Why start with winter? It's from a song on the music. Do I know that one? Winter land. Quiet head. Doesn't like music either. Got it. There. Better. House. Suma. House. No, -uh. that wasn't right. Write it. Better. House. Suma. House. Still nothing. Boy. Winter, spring. The order from the song spring. again. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. <laughs> Winter, spring, summer. Try that. Venter, house, sumar, house. Retrograde lads. What? Of course, there. Venter, house, sumar, sumar. The riddle. Winter is last. Here you go, brother. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. Try that. Vetter. House. Suma. Vetter. No. What me to... No. I just need quiet. Winter. Last. Sure you... Quiet. Winter is last. Retrograde. There. No. Var. Sumar. Vetter. Vetter. 
Once more, boy. The song. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. When reversed, winter is last. And autumn first. I know. Oh, I know, brother. Just uh, reminding you what you know, you know. Boy. Faust, Bauer, Suma, Vetter. I don't think we're ever making Winter, spring, summer, autumn. But reversed. Autumn first. Winter last. Winter, spring, autumn. When, okay, wait, hold on. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. But then if winter's last, autumn's there. So winter. Autumn? Okay, if winter's first, then autumn's last. Wait. Okay, so then it's. Winter, spring, autumn. Okay, winter, spring, summer, autumn. But autumn is first, winter is last. Boy. House. Vetter. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. But reversed. Autumn first. Winter. Winter last. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. Write it. That has to be it. House. Atreus, that word. Thola. It means endure. Try it. Well done, lad. Write it again. Thola. Horizon! The energy's lifting the platform. Keep writing. Thola. 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 Head. How is this possible? My guess? Temporal magic. Dangerous stuff the High Vanir gods used to play around with. The ability to freeze time. Happened to be a favorite of Njord himself, in fact. Used to? Why did they stop? Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them. Always looking to sink their teeth in. After that, they decided it was best to leave time alone. Writing before the floor collapses.
gonna hurry up and write it. Yeah. 